today's Monday and it's uh, nearly ten past six and we start today's chat whatever else you want to call it um, been a bit of a cock up on yesterday's one I uploaded it and someone didn't like the fact that they was in it so I better take that out sorry about that if you've already watched it you can get a chance to see it again slightly edited with the new title sequences which I'm still working on that's um they're temporary I've added some music to it I'm just trying to work out how to do effects with it and as you notice that I've done this new bit with the action cam uh, not with the action cam with the dash cam um, and music speed it up Ew, I think it looks quite good please somebody put some comments in let me know what you think of them and if you've got any ideas where I can change things around it'd be most appreciated um, I'm always open to ideas uh, right news first of all oh yes the, the young lady that stabbed her tinder date on boxing day or whenever it was over Christmas um, but she wants to be a medical student and a doctor a surgeon now so she's given the discharge because she's not going to be good for her to send her to prison could you imagine if that was the other way around hey isn't it a flaming joke and then you've got um well fortunately the guy was in Benadorm died that's a shame he was funny uh it's a shame he died and then we've got uh down we go look this is the usual rubbish usual crap 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 oh because um Kim Jong-un and the, the, his, the fat boy and his ilk reckon that Trump started a war now. Yeah. <laughs> Trump hasn't done anything. But it's amazing you read the comments and how um, it's all Trump's fault. Well, Trump hasn't done anything. And then it's the Daily Mail with their sensational headlines, the fail online. When you actually read the article, which most people don't, they just comment on these things. If you read the article, you can see that... Um, what the fat boy said is, if Trump flies his planes anywhere near Korea, he's going to shoot them down and he's going to wipe America off the face of the earth. Dream on, Sonny, you fat twat. Go and have another donut. Come across today, I was with a load of crap. Oh, Mia Cat got in, didn't she? And uh, the others don't want to work with her. And most of the day, the fail online has been leading the main headline in on their website has been super rich Arab sheikh snaps up a lavish five bedroom apartment for his family within a stone's throw of Harrods for 17 million pounds. I mean, that's been the lead story. Now, talk about rub your flaming noses in it. Us paupers, dream on. But we all know that the Daily Mail own Zupa and another state agent, so... It's in their interest to push around the prices of property. Stacks about poor Harry, Prince Harry. Do feel sorry for that poor bloke. He can't do right for doing wrong half the time. I'll call Benizer because it's the Labour Party conference. If anybody votes for Labour, you do need your bumps feeling, you really do. Oh, Ant's going around with Ant from from Ant and Deck fame has, hasn't got his ring on his finger, his wedding ring. After one is one is for a good reason for that. Uh, publicity, even. Oh, and because the, the other great one was the the woman that was the model, model, that was kidnapped um, and put up for slavery by the uh, Black Death Society. And the, the people that... Um, was arrested about actually turned around and said, well, actually, you know, it was she paid us. It was a put-up job. It was a sham. Oh, tell us something we didn't know. And that, I think, sums up the new, today's fail online news. Sweet and apple as usual. Oh, because Mum's Net, um, somebody from Mum's, Mum's Net, her, as soon as I see the word Mum's Net, it turns me off, um, saw a ball from Lewis's, a Christmas tree ball, and the, the decoration looked like sperm. These people, they must go looking for these things that's going to upset them. 
I really do. Your mum's there, God. And that's about it, I think. That is your lot. <laughs>